The other type of mask is called an image mask. In the file browser, locate the Locanda logo with the .psd extension. This is a Photoshop file that has the logo broken out into separate layers. Motion gives you several options for working with layered Photoshop files. Drag it to the group, but keep the mouse held down. A menu appears where you can choose to import all the layers merged into one, all the layers separately, or choose a specific layer. The layer names you see here are the names from Photoshop. Very nice. Choose Import All Layers. A new group appears within the current group, as do layers for each of the original Photoshop layers. Close this Locanda Logo Layers group. Now select the top clone layer, then go to the Object menu and choose Add Image Mask. The mask appears below the clone layer. In the HUD, there is a Mask Source Well, which is currently empty. We need to tell the image mask what to use to create the mask. Drag the Locanda Logo Layers group to the well in the HUD. Now turn off the rectangle mask. The clone layer, which contains the unaltered image, now only appears within the logo. In the HUD, try changing the source channel to luminance for a different look. Now, the mask is applied more strongly to the brighter areas of the logo, and dark areas are transparent. 